So let me show you how much I used to make on a regular night driving Uber in Las Vegas, since that was actually the main reason why I would get a Tesla, since the main expenses for an Uber driver are gas and maintenance, which I eliminated with that. I had to wait six months for my Tesla to arrive, so I actually decided to rent one two months prior to that, just to try it out. It was a little bit more expensive, but still worth it, and everyone in Vegas loved it. Everyone would always ask me questions and wants information about it, which even gives you more tips, more money and most of the time i would also use my techniques to obviously make the most money possible which would be just picking and choosing my rides so this is like a regular event day in vegas or a regular friday a regular saturday you have surges everyone who drives uber knows what they mean and then i would just sit in a i would say high populated area and just wait it out until i get a ride that makes sense for a lot of people that look at this are like oh this is a lot of money for one ride, right? Right? You don't just take it. And yeah, you just really have to utilize your time. You have to see where's traffic, where's no traffic. Some of the areas where crazy traffic due to construction, due to any roads to being blocked off because of any events. So you really have to sit there and wait it out. Oh, this is not bad. So I would just take that and just keep going like that. And at the end of the day, I would mostly make something around that $658, really good day. And, and then imagine driving a Tesla, which pretty much gives you zero expenses. Can anyone blame me?